All right, hey guys. Uh, this metal part has become loose on this adapter. I got this from Daiso. So if you want to see what's actually inside, here. Yeah, so yeah, it came off when I plugged the USB. That's it. This clay here is probably where the circuitry is. So there's like circuitry for the USB C. I bet there's a chip there to control for the for doing the USB 3.0 technology. This is usually 3.0, not usually 3.2 or 3.1. I do like it keep keep it like this because the, because it has exposed USB and you can still put this back again. When you put it back in, make sure the arrow matches. It doesn't come out the other way, huh? It only comes out one way. Well, you can put it like that, but see, you can't, can't really take this out. Oh, you can. Yeah, but... Yeah, it came loose when I was unplugging the USB. I was like, what? Then I took the piece off. That's it. It is super damn small. Got the USB C port here and the USB C on here. Now I, I do have this adapter, which this in here it does have USB C, but my iPad does not support USB C. See, this one's blue, this one's white. Possibly the blendings in. And plug this in here because you can see right there if it's in. And this is USB 3. So if I actually had this uh, in this adapter here, you mean I mean the metal casing, if I plug it in, it will go in fine. And I can actually just press it in like that. But if I unplug it, I didn't do it that time. Didn't do it that time, but before when I unplug it, I can do it again. Eh, doesn't even do it that much anymore. But I plug it back in. There we go. Look at that. That's that's what happened when I unplugged this. See, like the glue. On here, uh, look, came loose. I had no, this is my first time I've seen this come off. I like my blue one, but I hope you guys enjoyed a little bit of a in depth inside view of this adapter.